guys. What's up, Libra? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can be reversed. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that is below as well. All right, Libra immediate future. If you're interested, um, you can check out the join button below for the membership. You can get early access to all videos for all signs. All right, so let's shuffle it. Libra for the immediate future, please. Oh, shoot. Thank you. All right, so we got the Page of Swords, your energy, the Queen of Pentacles, Earth energy, and the Temperance, Sagittarius energy. There's healing that's coming. Um, it, it's kind of like there may have been some either pullback in communication or like somebody who was like researching something, looking up something. We're, we're going to kind of get into specifics, but it's an interesting energy because it does look like you're moving away from something, but it's like a progressive energy. So with the two, let's see the page of swords, please, for Libra. You also could be dealing with another um, air sign. All right, you got the Page of Swords, the Eight of Cups, and the Four of Pentacles. Looks like you're walking away from something over here or someone. Uh, could definitely be a can. Uh, this can be a. This is Cancer energy. Is Venus energy? This is a, a love, a mutual love, a mutual bond. But even if it's not a person, the thing is, um, you got the Eight of Cups and the Two of Cups. So both of those represent emotions. So it's kind of like. In some way, somebody is walking away or emotionally detaching from a situation. However, you got the Four of Pentacles here. So, um, you know, it's still somebody kind of holding one there. This could be something that, um, you know, you even saved up for a little while to do. All right. So with the Queen of Pentacles, you got the Six of Cups. You definitely have someone that's holding on here. You could be dealing with another, or sorry, with an earth sign. Uh, fire's here as well. So, sorry, you got the um, the Queen of Pentacles, the Six of Cups, the King of Wands, the Eight of Swords. Somebody's nervous here. So it's kind of like feeling one side pulling back or worried about walking away. This, this is earth energy up there. Um... So sometimes, you know, it can just be that energy in general change is worrisome or somebody has that, especially for their moon sign. But it feels like somebody really fears the distance, the emotional pain is there. If this is a person that you're walking away from, it really looks like somebody's taking some time for reflection, like inward introspection type energy. But, um... This King of Wands, even if you're not dealing with a fire sign, it's not always the type that, that'll that speak up, like in this particular situation. There could be a situation that like involves kids, but it's there is a lot of worry around like the distance, the separation that does cause emotional pain. So that's coming in as the obstacle. So with the temperance there for the outcome, that is Sagittarius energy. And that is healing. That is letting go. It's not this um, Three of Swords energy. You also have the star there. You have pretty heavy hitters for the outcome. The Moon, Cancer, Pisces, Energy, the Strength card. You have four major arcanas already there for the outcome. So there is an essence, like especially if somebody is walking away or not really talking much. There's a spying energy that's here. But for the outcome, there's a lot of healing. There is a lot of unknown, which can be scary. And that's just the moon energy right there. You may check your moon sign, like I was saying. But um, a lot of healing that's kind of taking place. It doesn't look like this King of Wands energy is 
Um, it, it feels like there's more pain there or more like heartbreak than what is just shown. Can I see the moon for the outcome? Because we see a lot of healing, but um, there is most definitely an energy, the judgment, another major arcana, an energy here that's still very much attached or not letting go. Tell me more about the moon. You got the page of wands. The death card, Scorpio energy. All right, I'm going to leave it there. There's a pretty big transformation here. It feels like you're letting go of something. You're releasing and you are overcoming or vice versa. A situation where there has been some pain or some distance or some challenges in general. There's a lot of like feeling okay and um, that painful energy not there and kind of moving on. And even with the death card there, that's like uh, forgiveness and release type energy. However, um, if this is a person, again, that you're walking away from, somebody is not moving, is not letting go. Although it may not seem like somebody is taking much action, um, still there. All right, Libra, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that is below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time. Bye.